It truly is a special place, a stadium every football fan should visit should he or she get the chance. The Santiago Bernabeu here in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray here on the commentary box and I'm joined for commentary by Lee Dixon. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It is Liverpool against Borussia Dortmund. Well, the first group stage of the Champions League is always exciting. Three points is vital for both teams to get off to a good start. Or a draw, mate. An easy meet for the keeper, given that cross. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting eleven. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander-Arnold in the fullback positions. Sadio Mane starts with Mohamed Salah out wide. And leading the attack today is the ultimate pressing machine, Roberto Firmino. going to forge ahead not to be in terms of the finish here's the starting 11 for Borussia Dortmund Roman Burki gets the nod in goal Mats Hummel starts alongside Manuel Akanji in central defence Julian Brandt plays alongside Axel Witzel in central midfield and in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack Opportunity it is, still possibilities, and no nonsense defensive clearance. And Witzel with it. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Here's Robertson, Sadio Mane now. Well, great read there to intercept. Dortmund throw in here. Maneuvering his way forward. Running towards goal. And it is the opening goal of the contest. Well, it was always going to be a tight game, but now all of a sudden, one team ahead. Things have got to change on both sides. So back in business in this match, and Borussia Dortmund hold the lead. Wijnaldum now. Possession changes hands, the interception there. There's no doubt about it, the UEFA Champions League has come a long way since it came into existence back in 1992-93. And there are many, Lee, who say it's the highest standard of football you'll see anywhere. Well, I think it is the best club competition uh, in the world, I think the competition at the top, at the end, near the final, etc., is what it is. But the tournament is strong throughout the group stages and then the knockout stages. It's the perfect format for me. Julian Brandt. A very high degree of difficulty for any goalkeeper. Sheer quality, quality of the shot, and certainly quality of the save. Corner kick played in. Dealing with the threat that was real. Surely! And a goal here for Borussia Dortmund. Can they be stopped? Well, let's see that strike again. First time is always very, very difficult to strike a ball. The timing has to be right, the technique has to be right. But above all, you have to concentrate on the ball as it's coming to you. You know you're not going to take a touch. Concentration is everything. It's going their way. 2-0. Wijnaldum now. And untidy there, Piszczek. Nothing wrong with that idea. And now waiting to pounce. It really is such a free-scoring performance. Just nothing the defenders can do about it, seemingly. Well, let's see that one again. It's all about the contact, does everything right. He's not bothered where the goal is. He knows where it is. He gets a beautiful strike on it. 
Well, sadly, we have to conclude that this hasn't really been a contest, but all credit to any side committed to scoring goals like this. Sancho. And the cross not quite accurate enough. Clattered away. Fabinho now. Mane. They don't normally need a second invitation to give it a go on the counter. The electronic board has been held aloft. Two additional minutes here. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. And that is that half time here. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. It's with Fabinho. Wijnaldum now. And showing fine vision. Mane. Mane not quite accurate enough. Ball lost. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Looks as though they might make real progress on the counter-attack. Not so. A real opening now. And on the basis of that effort, quite clearly, he's not wearing his shooting boots at the moment. Well, it was a strong effort. Used his laces, but uh, screwed it well off target. Here's Piszczek. And green space aplenty. Might be a chance here. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, as we look at this again, the keeper's every right to ask where his back line was. But 2v1 in the end, he's thinking now, is he going to pass or go around? He's got no chance. Well, it has been one-sided, but they deserve the plaudits for the fact that they've kept going and going. A promising sequence. And Witzel with it. Paco Alcata. Well, he needed to read it to get there, and did. It's with Roberto Firmino. A disadvantage Liverpool here. That's how to flummox the opposing defender. Had to come up with the ball and did. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Alcacer, he's in with a chance. Well, it's goal after goal after goal. Just no end to this. A brilliant display. Well, Derek, he can relax now. He's got the hat-trick fully deserved. Well done indeed. Well, sadly, we have to conclude that this hasn't really been a contest, but all credit to any side committed to scoring goals like this. Alexander Arnold. And with tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action potentially. And the offence sufficiently sinister to warrant a yellow card. Yes, agree with that one, Derek. He's got to be careful now. Not a very complicated catch for the keeper. Well, it's come down to the final 20 minutes here. And 
The throw in forthcoming. Here's Goodson now. Goodson. Can they convert? And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop it. Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. Well, it has been one-sided, but they deserve the plaudits for the fact that they've kept going and going. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Here's Goodson now. An incisive pass. Still alive. Cleared away comprehensively. Lukas Piszczek with it. It needs an accurate cross. Running towards goal. And it's gone in. Well, just look at this, they all back off him and he takes the advantage, he goes through one, two, three, in the end it's a wonderful solo goal. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. It's with Fabinho. And five minutes to go. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Slade Chamberlain moving forward effectively. Fabinho now. Salah just straying offside. It's with Mats Hummers. Dahoud. Oh, a lovely ball. Azar. It could be up for grabs. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Full time then, and the ideal start for Borussia Dortmund. They have three points from their first match in the Champions League. Yeah, really, really strong start. That's what you need. But with five games to go, very important you stay in the now. One game at a time, Derek. Bit of a cliche. Nothing wrong with that idea. And now waiting to pounce. It really is such a free-scoring performance. Just nothing the defenders can do about it, seemingly. And green space aplenty. Might be a chance here. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Alcacer, he's in with a chance. Well, it's goal after goal after goal. Just no end to this. A brilliant display. Here's Goodson now. Goodson. Can they convert? And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop it. It needs an accurate cross. Good, sir. Running towards goal. And it's gone in. 